I bought this massive 500 millimeter lens for wildlife photography, and today we're gonna be doing exactly that here in the Great Smoky Mountains. As much as I wanted to, I wasn't sure I was gonna make it back to the Smokies this spring. It's been a busy few months, and despite the fact that, in reality, I probably shouldn't have been spending the time and money to make this trip, I decided to go for it. It had just been too long since I had last seen a bear, so, as you can see, here I am again, looking for bears. And within an hour of entering the park, mission accomplished. So guys, it is uh, very early in the morning and I've had a great shoot with the bears last night in the park and hopefully gonna have another great day in the park today. Um, but I actually forgot my uh, sleeping bag and sleeping pad at home. And by home, I mean like home home, not like school home at my dorm. And I was driving from school home, but I didn't really have the ability to go get it before I came. Um, so I had to improvise. Got a foam pad, comforter and a pillow. Was it comfy? Not really. Uh, but is it worth it to spend a whole weekend here in the Smokies? Absolutely. Now let's go find some wildlife, guys. After a short night's sleep in the truck, I was up early and back in the park well before sunrise. Since I got some bears the night before, this morning I wanted to focus on a different subject. So guys, as you can see, I've got a turkey out here. Um, it's a tom, and obviously you can hear him. It is mating season for turkeys right now, um, so they're out here strutting, and um, yeah, I'm getting some really cool photos and videos. I'm really happy to get this because I was hoping to get a good diversity, more than just bears this morning, and uh, turkeys specifically were exactly what I was hoping to find. So this is really awesome. I'm gonna keep shooting, see what else I can get. For the rest of the day, I explored Cade's Cove, both on foot and by car.
There weren't many good shots to be made as the lighting got harsh above, but I still saw bear after bear after bear, and I decided to still film and photograph them, even if the lighting wasn't perfectly ideal. And actually, while we're on the topic of bears, this would be a great time to remind you all that I'm going to be giving away a free trip to Lake Clark National Park to photograph coastal Alaskan brown bears when I hit 10,000 subscribers. All you have to do for a chance to enter in this giveaway is be a subscriber to the channel. So if you haven't already, subscribe and then join me in Alaska. It was a long, great day in Cades Cove, and when sunset finally arrived, I was able to find a massive male black bear to photograph. So guys, it's evening now, and um, I've been searching tirelessly for bears, and um, we're almost out of light, but we're not quite out of light yet, and uh, thankfully, finally, I found some bears. So uh, I'm gonna get over here really quick, because like I said, we're running out, but um, we'll back and get some good photos. And when I found this bear, the sun was already dipping below the horizon, and we were getting into that beautiful, moody, blue hour light. I had the perfect shot envisioned for when this bear stood up, where I would have him in the bottom corner of the frame with the green grass around him, the taller yellow grass behind him, and the beautiful blue mountains in the background. So I waited and waited and waited for the bear to stand up, and then finally, just as the light was getting almost too low to shoot, he finally stood up, looked right at me, the shot that I had been envisioning presented itself. Always bring an extra battery. The next morning, I went back into the park, this time with a fully charged battery in my camera, for one last shoot before I headed home. I drove the Cove Loop a few times and saw many bears, but none in great photographic conditions. Finally though, just before the light got too harsh to shoot in, the bears delivered for me once again. So it has been an awesome morning here in Cades Cove. Um, had 15 different bears in two hours this morning, which is just insane. Uh, most of them were way too far out to get any photos. Um, but as you saw, I did get some photos and videos um, of the one family of the mother with three cubs. Um, still though, the best photos of the whole weekend um, had to be on the first day um, when I got here. I got some really beautiful, intimate moments that I captured between the mother and the cub that were just perfect. So those were definitely the best photos of the trip um, to me because those moments were just amazing to capture on camera. And to give a little bit of background, that family of bears I've actually photographed twice now, um, once back in November, which I did a whole different video on. If you'd like to check that out, I'll link it right up here. And um, then also on this weekend, and both times I've watched that cub take his walnuts over to his mother and he sits down there, drops his walnut, and whines until she cracks the walnut open for him. 
and then he eats it, um, which is just such a cute and uh, really cool thing to witness. Um, the other two cubs do their own thing. They crack their walnuts, but uh, that cub has learned with a little bit of persuasion, mom will do it. So it's just really cool to watch. And uh, it was that was basically what was going on in those photos that you saw. But anyways, overall, it was an awesome weekend here in the Smokies and uh, probably my last weekend in the Smokies for a while because uh, as many of you know already, um, if you're a regular viewer of the channel, um, I'm headed back out to Yellowstone uh, to spend the rest of the year and uh, just two weeks from when this video comes out. So because of that, um, I probably won't be back to the Smokies for a long time to come, um, which is unfortunate. But if you would like to see some more of my work from the Smokies, I will link a playlist up here that is entirely uh, Great Smoky Mountains videos. And with that, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. I wanna remind you all to subscribe for that Alaska trip giveaway. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I will see you all in the next one.